Alright, today I'm talking about a Rebel Scholar case. It's a gunmetal, what's it, gunmetal gray, I think it is. I ordered it last Friday. That's my favorite thing about it. I ordered it last Friday and it got here Monday morning. So it took eh, four days to get here, three. And that was pretty quick. So here's the box basically. You got Rebel Scholar. The top says the website, rebelscholar.com. Got the logo, the RS. And you got a little cutout so you can see your case. It's a little gunmetal case. So let's open it up and see what's up. Oh, you can hear the cars outside, but it's too late to close the window now. Nice little foam protective thing to keep your case safe. It's basically it, a slider case. Let's see if that notch. And it got two rubber rails in, inside of it. I guess for some shock protection. Looks like it says rebelscholar.com inside. Completely blank on the outside. Cut off for the camera, power switch, headphones, volume, everything's cut out nice on the bottom. So I already I already used this case. I just put it right back in the in the box to show you guys a little unboxing. I know people like to see that. But I already used this case once and could see it did give me a scratch. Oh, let me see. Right there. You can see that? And I don't think it gave me any more. Well there is one more but it's barely visible. I don't think you'll be able to see that. No, but you do see this one right here. I guess it was from the bottom. I did check it if it had any flash. And I couldn't find anything. But it just slides. Let's see. It just slides in, and I guess this bottom piece is a piece that scratched it. Anyways, this is how the case goes on. Just slide it right in. You can see that right there. It's lifting up my screen protector. Slide it in. Be very careful. I don't want to get more scratches. And then it has a little opening in the bottom. For the second piece, it's pretty nice. Perfect fit. It doesn't. Well, I guess you do hear a noise. I don't know what that's from, but looks like it's on there pretty tight. Feels really good. Got the headphones. Switch is all easy to get to. A lot easier than the candy shell. Everything. Very flush right here. Let's see. You can see that I got some air bubbles on the screen protector. I got a soft card right here. They do. Well, hopefully they come off. Look, it comes off, but as soon as you press on the case, it comes right back. That's something I didn't like about the case. I guess I got to get some screen protectors that fit on here better. 
and that's basically it. I like how it feels. It feels like it's right on there. Very feels very safe. You get a little lay on the table. So yeah, it, you're safe. If you put it on the table, it won't hit your screen. Is what I'm trying to say, but. The thing I worried about most was the uh, scratches and the chrome doesn't really scratch but let's see Let get this. I did get that one scratch and that sucks but what are you gonna do I didn't get anything else though everything else is perfect Nice. I guess I just got unlucky. But yeah, I like the case a lot, except for that one scratch. I've heard other people didn't get any scratches at all. And uh, it's a Rebel Scholar case. I got this one. This is a $20 version. There's a $34 version, or $35, and also a $100 version that has laser etching on the back of the case. So it's kind of see-through. And uh, pick them up at rebelscholar.com. You can subscribe to my videos, rate them, comment please. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you got any scratches on this case. I would like to know that one right there. Because I'm kind of bummed on my scratch. But what are you going to do? So yeah, subscribe if you like the videos. And... Check out some of my other videos and my other cases. And uh, see you later.